Hello and welcome everyone, I'm Tenerife Tez on the sunny island of Tenerife currently uh, going to do a little walk around the outside of the Mediterranean Palace uh, this is August 2023 and we'll see what progress they've actually made if any is visible I'll uh, try and point it out to you because the camera may not pick up everything uh, which is going on here so from the outside the big sign's gone across the top which was the Notre Dame all disappeared I wonder if they're going to replace that with something else or rebrand the place Go on. Um, possibly are I don't know we'll have to wait and see on that one folk just risking his life there there is lots of screed still around here but uh, that's only to be expected to stop people from uh, viewing and try and make the place look a little bit more uh, I suppose aesthetically pleasing if it can there's the company who's actually doing the uh, restoration or uh, remodeling if you like not quite a lot happening around here but uh, there is a lot happening inside rest assured it's well on its way but I'll try and point uh, out what's happening as we go around for those people who don't know where it's located it is uh, on what is classed as the Golden Mile opposite the Safari Centre Safari Centre being on the right hand side and uh, Mediterranean Palace here look at. there you go all the mattresses etc have gone all the windows are undone and as you can see plenty of, of uh, work has happened inside but uh, we'll keep on going and uh, see if we can find out more around the corner Another better view there of the uh, Safari Centre but I'm sure you know where this is if you've uh, been to Tenerife before. Not altered the colour yet on the outside, there is one or two areas which is painted a little bit greyer but um, I wonder if that's the colour they're going to uh, stick to or is it going to uh, change to something totally different. If any of you know anything about that please feel free to make a comment. So continuing on let's uh, have a look what's going to be around the corner see if we can get a better view of stuff so uh, come with me then folk let's uh, take a look it's very very quiet it is early morning today so uh, don't let that put you off with the area folk because uh, people haven't woken up just as yet maybe late nights or uh, maybe around the pool there is a lot to do as you know in Tenerife anyway but uh, there you go all the flags are still out nobody around the uh, safari centre but the shops open a little bit later on because they are open uh, late into the evening anyway as you can see the building on the left hand side that's where the magic is and the Hard Rock um, Cafe not to get confused with the Hard Rock Hotel which is located in, in Paraparizo which is a totally different resort and uh, people do get confused expecting that hotel to be around here but, um, I'm sure you know that anyway Cleopatra on the right hand side now more work is being carried out on this side you may not be able to see it from the camera folk but these rooms have got suspended ceiling framework fitted they have got first and second fitment of uh, electrics water and air conditioning which means soon the ceilings will be going up the repair work for where they've uh, chopped out for all the plumbing and electrics will be repaired and some of these rooms will then be ready for refitting wardrobes or bathrooms etc etc you may just be able to make out the, the ceilings in some of these but um, that's what's happening currently over here you can see some of the pipe work as well on the lower floors so progress is well on its way it looks like they're doing this by batches so all the pipe work all the electrics and then uh, different tradesmen pop in which is the correct way to do it sun's nicely on the Cleopatra over there it's a very very beautiful area around here nothing's happened around the pool area though so maybe that's going to get left or just uh, 
fettled up. What do you think? So there you have it viewers. Sir Anton is now open. This one's due to open possibly later in the year. Um, they are actually selling some holiday packages. Whether they'll get cancelled, I don't know. So uh, I'd like to uh, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.